I? Why should I be calm? I have a right to be upset! This is so sick and fucking twisted! Sick and twisted! Different place will everybody please give them a little bit of space Get a load of this train wreck I'll pop a block in your mouth and make a brain slushy I have more creative skills I have more friends and just like that, you've been blocked. <laughs> and just like that, you've been blocked. It feels like flying, but maybe we're dying. Hey, wanna listen to some tunes? Yo, Yo. MF Doom. Fuck me in the rain, I wanna have everything they did. It's time to take your final Big Weenie. What a day. Hmm? You look lonely. I can fix that. Playing alone, you'll be answering twice. Be easy for you, Geminis. How did he know I was a Gemini? What the fuck? I did not put my birthday in! Big questions in a girls shop in sizes that are too small letters. Girls look better in a real tight sweater. 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 Girl Underestimate me. That'll be fun. I love being me. It pisses off all the right people. <laughs> Wait. You don't remember what she looks like. Hey, just make something up. <laughs> Must have been. 
Art Part 2. I accidentally posted this to my story and cried, but anyway. I think I know the trick when doing art. Instead of trying to copy line for line, learn the shapes of the facial features you're referencing, figure out the facial mapping, and then put it all together. If I can do it, you can too. Try to deceive me. I'm tired of listening to you. You gave me your heart, you know. You'd like me to hand it back whole again, but I won't. You will live a long time yet, Catherine, an eternity without me. You will look into the faces of passers-by, hoping for something that will, for an instant, bring me back to you. You will find moonlit nights strangely empty, because when you call my name through them, there will be no answer.
Hi, so I think it's fairly obvious from my art that I'm into a sort of alternative punk aesthetic, and um, I definitely vibe with that. Uh, but in our community, we talk a lot about revolution, and I'm just, I'm a little confused. Are we meaning like a socialist revolution, or are we talking about anarchy? Um, they're kind of like complete opposites, so I'm so confused why there's such an overlap in like the aesthetics of it and i'm uh, uh, help me out a bit here how i draw bodies yeah. as always i start with a circle dorito head monkey ear a rectangle for the chest square Presume for the waist. A triangle for the crotch area. Circle, circle, neck. Hoot leg. Another hoot leg. to rectangles that are roughly the same size for the arms hand hand hopefully it helped a bit boom boom strich und strich nicht vergessen es soll nicht dünn sein also die 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 müssen so ein bisschen fett sein also nicht diesen fehler machen Danach geht Minecraft los. Strich und dann so welche Sachen. Es fängt von hier und dann auch von hier. Und danach noch diese Dinger. Und noch diese. Zwei Strichs und danach ein Kreis. Muss wegradieren. Wenn ihr so welche Stifte habt von Teddy, dann benutzt 136. Smashy. Boom. Yo. Ba. Also ihr müsst alles umranden. Hauptsache man kann noch die Linien erkennen. Und jetzt diese hier. Und danach hier am meisten. Und hier auch. Nutzt dann die normale Hautfarbe und danach könnt ihr damit malen. Jetzt hast du dein Sixpack. Okay, so in my last video I received a lot of hate comments. So, I'm going to address this video. So, a lot of non-artist and artist in the art community were hating on the way I draw characters, my ox moths, etc. One thing I have to say is artists have different art styles, different shapes and sizes for noses, eyes, mouth, body parts. People who hate should feel shameful and guilty about how you criticize the way other artists draw or learn their style of art. If you want to hate on someone else's art, Take a look at yours and make a change if you have something mean to say about that person just as tf you. You aren't better in any way. Hating on a artist's art is totally disrespectful and rude. So just stop and be a better person.
that you wouldn't tell anyone. You promise. I can't believe you lied. You have only yourself to blame. You came to me with your tragic little story. I didn't ask you. I like to draw. Really? Yeah. You gotta show me some. No. You gotta show me some. Come on, let me see. No, alright, I'm gonna show you. Alright, bet, 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 bet. Okay, okay. Huh? your tragic little story. I didn't ask you. with a hot iron once I'm into BDSM don't judge me I'm not cute the American dream is dead but if I get elected president I will bring it back bigger better stronger bigger better better stronger bigger bigger better stronger bigger better better stronger bigger
wanted to do like a fun little thing where people could like, you know, if you like to draw me or you thought I looked cool with my pink hair, feel free to draw me and send it to me and I might use this as my profile picture. Yeah, people, people were going to get mad at this one. That was just bound to happen, unfortunately. For anyone who doesn't know me, my name is Bowie. I'm an illustrator and that is a motorcycle. And I can happily explain to you what everyone's issue with this was and how we can avoid it in the future. First things first, though, no hate to Caroline at all. A lot of content creators do this because a lot of them don't know why so many artists take issue with it. So we are here to inform, not to insult. Everything's fine. We're all chill. Let's just get into it. So what Caroline was describing in her video is usually referred to as speculative work or spec work in the art community. So in its barest form, spec work is essentially when companies or brands and now content creators will ask artists and creatives to create content for them in the hopes of some kind of outcome that is perceived to be beneficial to the artist, as in logos or profile pictures in this case, or anything of that sort that is to believe to be beneficial to that artist. A lot of the time, spec work also can involve monetary rewards, and this case did not. Most cases with content creators don't. In my opinion, that is better for the artists in the end for a lot of reasons that aren't relevant to this video, so we're not getting into it. I, if anyone's curious, I can't explain that later, but this case didn't, so we're good. We're fine. Just know spec work can't involve money sometimes. One of the biggest issues with spec work, uh, there's a lot, but one of the main ones is that it provides the company or brand or person who is engaging in it with a lot of different work and a lot of varying styles and portrayals and all of that good stuff, but they don't have to pay for it like they typically would if they just went about it with commissioning an artist. Again, I'm not accusing anyone of doing this intentionally, but that is one of the main issues is you get to so much content and that basically the ability to pick and choose without having to pay for the ability to pick and choose. Now, all of this isn't to say that every single art contest is spec work. It's usually when the art that is being made is to the benefit of whoever is holding said contest is spec work. Otherwise, they're typically fine. Uh, so that's why in the case of content creators, just asking people for art, that's why it's so problematic. Well, at least one of the several reasons. And obviously, uh, I'm never going to discourage content creators from engaging with the artists in their community. That's great. The way that Caroline was going about it before when she would uh, pick out fan art that had already been made as her profile picture and credit them and everything. That is great. But yeah, that's why people got a bit upset. Uh, if you have any questions on how to go about this sort of thing in a more productive way with your community, I would love to make more videos or you can comment any questions down below. I have a better plan. I'll marry a wealthy man. Wouldn't that make you gay? Not necessarily. That would be. And I guess I'll just miss her. Even though she is a
You look lonely. I can fix that. I killed myself. She's smiling at me and telling me that she loves me, and I just look at her and I can't muster up anything. You're spending the night with me What do you want from my world? You're a good little girl I'll take you down to a slaughterhouse Fuck the law, my death to the top
do. Let's make an artwork to go with this sketchbook cover. I want it to match my bloodbath Lydia keychains. I have a bunch of pose sketches that might fit, but I decided to go with something new. I've never done a back view pose for decorated sketchbook before. This way the focus will be more on the wings and outfit details than the character's face. I think it creates a nice little bit of contrast, especially since the background is very detailed. I usually sketch in pen for my ink drawings, but I decided to experiment a little with color before inking as well. I usually add color after inking, but coloring this way made the sketch more than just planning for the drawing. This was so fun to do, and I love how it turned out. Paper. Pencil. And not a mechanical pencil, because mechanical pencils are known to explode. For example, look what happens when I just <laughs> step one, circle, step two, line, step three, whatever this is, nice, step four, the delicious little ears, congratulations, you have the basic face shape down, now on for the body, one, neck, don't forget the little the little shading if it'll just fo focus the camp step i forgot this will be our collarbone i know it's very difficult but i believe in you the body shape can obviously be differently than what i'm about to do but i'll just draw what i did for the drawing that you just saw Ooh. this shape this shape this shape, the exquisite little calf muscles. Now for the arms, you just gotta eat. Ooh, ooh. Yeah, arms are really difficult. I don't like them. I think we should just get rid of arms as a whole. I think that'd be helpful. Shablam! Nice. We got the nice little feetsies. Now for my mortal enemy, the hands. Uh, 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 uh. Nice. Ish. Okay, time to show you how I did it. Bloop, blop, bleep, blarp, blog and schnoff. That's the basic body shape, but whoa. Okay, let me let me fix these legs. Shoo, shwap, eek eek, blop, blop, shkiwa. Okay, now we have the basic thing down. Okay, now on for the detail. Eyeball. Eyeball. Triangle. Ooh. Comment what kind of clothes and hair and everything else you want to see on this beautiful creature. As for the tutorial, I hope you liked it. Now go have fun. Goodbye. <laughs>
cute. Can you turn around for me? Yeah. Hey, wanna listen to some tunes? Yo, Yo. MF Doom. Fuck the underrated, I wanna have everything they did. Friends, bitches, need money, why sell gold chain, Maserati, penthouse, helicopter, fame.
dum pam pam ba dum pam ba 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 dum pam pam ba dum.